Backing up your Salesforce instance is a process that every single business needs to implement. Although Salesforce stores your data on some of the most secure servers around, there is always potential for data to be lost through user error or configuration issues on the platform. So here are five things you need to know about backing up your data on Salesforce. While the possibility of Salesforce losing your data exists, the chance of this happening is pretty slim and I've only heard of a few edge cases of this happening during very rare downtime. So this isn't really the primary reason you need a Salesforce backup solution. The most likely cause of losing data will come from user error and could be for one of the following reasons. Issues during mass import. If you're using tools such as Data Loader to modify thousands of records in a few seconds, there is every possibility that you could overwrite important data or even delete records that can be wiped off the CRM forever. Rogue automation or integration. Deploying a buggy Apex trigger, flow or integration has the possibility to overwrite or delete data that could mean mass data loss or corruption. User error. Mistakes from either a Salesforce user or a Salesforce admin are entirely possible at any time. When you think of a Salesforce backup solution, you are probably thinking about backing up Salesforce records, but it's also important to back up metadata. Metadata includes all of your custom configuration on Salesforce, what fields you've created, the flows you've set up, as well as any Apex code or custom lightning pages. If you have multiple people working on your Salesforce instance, or your company works alongside a Salesforce partner, it's not unheard of for people to accidentally overwrite others' changes or as has happened to me on multiple occasions, someone refreshes an active sandbox you're working in. This situation can of course be devastating and can overwrite weeks or even months of work. Salesforce does offer various native backup solutions, most of which are free. However, it's important to note that these free tools do not recover your data. They simply give you the ability to export your data and metadata. For data backup, you've got Data Export Service, a nifty feature that allows you to back up your entire Salesforce instance to a CSV. You can schedule these backups to automatically prepare weekly or monthly. Data Loader, a Salesforce admin's best friend. The Data Loader gives you the export data from one individual object at a time. Great for backing up an object before a mass import. Report Export, a simple way to export the data out of Salesforce using the reports interface. For metadata backup, you've got Change sets. You can use change sets to copy metadata from one Salesforce org to another, such as from production to sandbox or a developer org. Sandbox refresh. By refreshing a sandbox, you're essentially taking a refresh copy of your production org. DevOps Center. A new solution from Salesforce that allows you to use modern DevOps best practices to move metadata to a Git repository. Finally, Salesforce does actually have a paid backup and recovery tool. However, since it was released a couple of years ago, not much information is publicly available. If all hope fails and you do run into a situation whereby you need to recover lost data, Salesforce can help you, but it does come with a $10,000 price tag. Salesforce has to keep backups of all your data in case they are at fault. So they are happy to dip into this archive, but it will cost you and take a number of weeks. This is why Salesforce generally advocates for using third-party backup providers on their app exchange. And finally, Salesforce App Exchange Solutions. Salesforce has a great selection of premium backup and restore products available on the App Exchange. Most of these products have been around for years, meaning they are complete solutions that you can purchase and have peace of mind that you can restore data at any point in only a few clicks. A few of our favorites include Own Backup, one of the largest providers that has over 4,000 customers on their solution. They also have products for security enhancements to Salesforce, sandbox seeding, and data archiving. Gearset, one of the leading DevOps platforms for Salesforce and also has a comprehensive platform for data and metadata backup. AutoRabbit, another leading Salesforce DevOps platform that includes a product called Vault. AutoRabbit specializes in building products for regulated industries such as financial services. Odyssey, coming from a slightly different angle, selling themselves as an enterprise proven Salesforce data management solution, this includes data backup as well as data privacy and compliance tools. Salesforce data and metadata backup is vitally important for all Salesforce professionals to consider as part of their org strategy. It's important to ask yourself the following questions to determine the solution that's right for you. How much does the business depend on Salesforce? 
What would the restore process be in the event of a data or metadata loss? How long does this process take and what would the impact be to the business? How many Salesforce deployments are you performing on a monthly basis? Deployments will always have a risk associated for data or metadata loss to occur. The more deployments you are carrying out, the higher the risk. The native Salesforce backup solutions available could be suitable for some smaller businesses, but I'd recommend checking out some of the paid solutions available.